Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel once again, the vlogs of Dr. Blogger. Uh, uh, this episode is completely about uh, quarantine with a Dr. Blogger. Quarantine is a tough job. Uh, uh, I'm going to show you all what I am trying to do uh, to keep myself uh, up and engaged because uh, yesterday was a very hard day for me. Karnam, I, for the past one year, uh, I've been with my friends, my car my home that i call hostel my bed so every i was completely i was so attached to those things and in the uh, airport in uh, because <laughs> it's sad to say goodbye to your close ones of course i had to because i have my family here and uh, any further things are going to be here hopefully inshallah yeah, I'm happy sad mood of a or a happy mood like a very many but what I did is that is what I'm going to show you through this vlog. What I did is I tried to make this place feel like home. That is the first thing that I have to do because for the next uh, six, five, six days, this is going to be home. And the sleep rhythm is correct because I just came in yesterday. Because we wake up in India at 839 and I was like, okay, let me check the time in India and exactly the same time. Appointments and clock are then in the bathroom, I had a dose of 5, around 8.30 over here. I was tired, plus I had a time of 5. I wanted to make this place feel like home. For that reason, I started, first of all, I started with uh, my pebbles. I bought her all the way from India to Qatar, completely packed, very beautiful. Uh, then, pebbles were unpacked. I placed it over my table. And I have this chokers, so I call her chokers. She is she is amazing. It's very easy to express your emotions with her. So I was this yesterday. I was sad. I was sad. Okay, I was sad for leaving my friends, uh, and I was sad because I had to leave the country. I had to leave my car, my bee. I was really attached to her, and also I was sad because I had my eyebrows done yesterday, and I got a very tiny cut over here and it hurts so that was not supposed to happen however today i turned her into pink okay which is happy uh, i got her from amazon so she is really good handy and is very easy to express your emotions with her and when i see her in the corner i find it really cute and lights up my mood now I have a favorite picture of uh, me and my husband from Phuket. I place that picture on my table so that it completes my table. And I started reading a book. That is, I have everything set right beside on my table. That is Think Like a Monk. This is a very good positive book. Because I was very busy, now I started reading that again. So, you should really check this book out, it's really good. Now, that is how I made this place first of all feel like home. And the second thing that I did was uh, I started working out, I started doing my room workout. Okay, first, uh, after setting my table, I went to have a coffee. Okay, I a kettle and a coffee. I had my coffee prior to my workout because a coffee gives you a lot of energy to do workouts. And now we are having our coffee and we are next off to workout. Doing workout uh, is one of my things. I start making myself comfortable wherever I am. So I did workouts with my stretch bands. 
that I purchased. Uh, then came in my breakfast. Breakfast to Anupa and almost a Korean and a bad mood of Kapoi because breakfast was too good. Uh, they had everything like vegetables, salads, uh, fruits, uh, sausages, croissants. I had to go to the house. So, initially, after my workout, I went to have my light breakfast, which was fruits and vegetables. I went into a shower and then I came back and had my meal. I had to do some face uh, nourishment because for the past few days I've been traveling around a lot in India I didn't get time to look after my skin so uh, I started focusing on my skin again so don't mind my beanie cap because it's cold here I moved out from India to Qatar and the temperature kind of here is cold also I added on something that really looks cute to my outfit I know it's really tough to be in quarantine because I'm doing one and trust me it's very boring but you got to keep yourself happy boring boring by the time you get out of this place you're going to be a boring person you're going to find it really difficult to keep yourself up after that especially when you lose your energy it's very difficult to bring it all back again you got to do things that you love to do especially uh, reading books if you don't read books, watch some series. And I did my thing, which is workout. I started doing a lot of other things like taking care of my face, my hair. So, I'm going to do that. The second thing is my uh, blogging and logging, both on my Instagram and on my YouTube. So, I'm trying to keep it up to date. If you have any interesting things in this video, you can see some things that make you happy. This is what I am trying to do. And if you have some tips, do mention on my comment box. I will of course see through it. And I hope in that for 4 to 5 days. So I will be making some vlogs of course. Until then, bye bye, take care. And if you are new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe. Click the bell icon, like, comment and share.